previously on Hardline. That's Leo Ray. Says he has information regarding the drug war that's plaguing Miami. I had everything on platter, and you fucked it up. You sure like fucking it. You're both excellent at improvising and terrible about keeping things quiet. What the hell just happened? Alrighty, welcome back to Battlefield Hardline. They've thrown us right in the thick of things. We're gonna have to go and see how we're gonna splice these episodes up together. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's try not to shoot our own friend as well. Alright, heal up a little bit. They're only shooting me over on that side. Oh, yeah, yeah, there's just too many of them. Way too many of them. I'm assuming that guy's dead now. He should be dead. Going prone actually helps you out a lot to not being hit. I don't think we've really been hit once or twice. Maybe once, twice. There we go, that guy should have carked it. No, he's getting back up. And he's ready to run. God damn. How many bullets does he take? I think that's it though. And then there was one. Oh, no, maybe not one. Let's come right up around here. We've completely run out of bullets, so that means we are going to have to run over that guy's body and take some hints. You know what? Let's just use the scan right now. Okay, we can get some weaponry. Okay, so there doesn't seem to be anything really over here. Finally. First, I want to make sure if there's any hints. Nope. No evidence for us to collect. All right, let's go continue on. Thank you guys so much for all the support that you guys have given me over the first couple of episodes. Be advised, we have backup in route. I am editing out all my massive fails though, so that's why there might be some um, like edits that you guys might be able to notice. I try to make them as non-intrusive as possible, as we are just about to get absolutely destroyed by all these guys. Whoa, well, you destroyed the little crate that I was hiding behind. Die already, friend. Die. These guys definitely last a while. Oh, they're not coming. Oh, he, he is coming up over here. Red should mean that they're dead after that one shot. Clearly it doesn't. Guys, cross there, turn red. Oh. Jeez, that shotgun definitely pays dividends to have. Alright, let's make sure there's no one on either side. Oh, I would not want to take a shotgun that close. To be honest, I really wouldn't want to take a shotgun shot at all, but definitely not that close right to the belly. Oh, there you go, friend. He's dead. Um, what am I getting shot at? Why was my health decreasing? Let's go prone when it comes to this guy as well. Just wait up a little bit. Until we've reloaded and... Oh, fuck. Bang off with his head. No, he's not off with his head. Hi, we're clear. We'll go back to being silenced for the time being. And uh, wish me luck. I'm assuming there's going to be a lot more guys coming up right around here. Guy, you find anything? I hate how they all know that we're here, though. We can't really hide it, hide the fact that um, we're there to capture them. Um, where exactly can we go get some ammo? It must be down below, isn't it? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, seems like their other police team is going to breach this doorway over here. We're in. Engaging suspects. But I really want to go get some more ammo. Anyways, I guess I'm just going to have to walk over the dead bodies. Very easy hip fire in a game like this, which I'm not complaining about at all either. It's just pretty cool. 
Um, let's make sure there's no evidence around over here. It doesn't seem like there is. Okay. I think this is still part of episode three, to be honest. I'm not quite sure. Although I wouldn't have thought it. Nels, put the gun down. Now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I took the deal. You, Stoddard, take it all. I'm out of here. Put the piece down. Then we can talk about Stoddard, this deal, whatever else you want. What the hell was that, Stoddard? Looks like I just saved your life, Mendoza. He was surrendering. Leave it alone, partner. I say you were in danger. Right. He was dangerous because he was talking about your deal. Leave it alone. The yeah. hell I will. No, no, no. I'm curious. What, did Nels say something interesting, Nick? We're done here. Now listen to your partner. She's a smart lady. Here. Before evidence arrives. You're kidding. There you go, Nick. Congrats on a job well done. Smart lady. Now I see why. Definitely ta doesn't take his job by the book. So that was episode three, a gator bait, with a rather surprising end. I thought that boat scene, that speedboat scene, would have been the end of um, episode three. But here we go with episode four, which will probably be what this episode will be called. It's clear that Detective Carl Stoddard is dirty. What's less clear is who else is on the... I've got no idea what else that said. We've got four guys to capture now. Seems like these missions will be getting longer and longer as well because we've got so many people to capture. But let's go watch this little cutscene. Yes, Your Honor. Well, I disagree with your basic assessment of the facts. No, I understand. Thank you for your time. That was the Honorable Naomi Kushner. What do we think about Judge Kushner around these parts? Left-wing hack. Yes, the good judge won't give me a no-knock warrant for known associates of Nelts. And that's just fine. War games, war rules. Mm. <sighs> Captain Dawes, I... Mendoza, the three of us are a tribal council. And I'm very aware that we're having problems with one of the members of our tribe. He didn't take the money. <laughs> you were testing me. <laughs> well, we had to know if we could trust you. you know, from the very beginning, your partner assured me that we could. Now, you said that Nels was talking about a deal with Stoddard. Yeah, he sure did. Well, I need you to go back to Nels's office and get me something that I can take to Internal Affairs. I realize that a hurricane's incoming, detectives. But this can't wait. Yes, sir. Jesus! CSI's already been through here. What's the point? Well, they weren't looking for evidence against Stoddard. Look, we find anything, we go directly to Dawes. This goes to internal affairs. Dawes can't control what happens. You do trust Dawes, right? Stoddard going down doesn't look good for anyone. Now, Stoddard's dirty. You know it, I know it. I'll keep watch out here. You go inside, find the evidence we need to take him down. Gladly. Not sure if we should really trust it, to be honest. Especially leaving us out all alone. Maybe poke through the trash. To take out all these enemies. Idea. Just stay this in ice is I? Some drug? Okay. Anyways. You think Stoddard has friends inside the department? Probably. Dirty cops look out for each other. Let's hope they didn't pull any evidence. Wouldn't surprise me. If Stoddard was stupid, he'd be in jail. Right, so let's just keep on using this. What the hell does it want me to do? I think it wants me to go look down, doesn't it? Well, it seems like we're right on top of where... Are we? Yeah, we're definitely right on top of where they want us to go. So it means that we're going up or down. 
let's go ahead and explore. And I think the answer is up to our question. Because that's the only way that we can go. Seems like that's all blocked up. I think I'm gonna might have to take down some of the, my own police department. I mean, who, who could out be our enemies here? Very interesting. I think we're going to go driving in that car, maybe. It's definitely going to be a change of scenery. Nothing around here. Oh, here we go. Talking Tamu Tamu Stuffy. There he is. As we can scan him through the wall, that's kind of normal. Where else are we going? Somewhere, I'm assuming back up the stairs yet again. It's really good how your phone goes off though. Just to give you that preemptive warning. Somebody moved this recently. Isn't that a pretty famous painting, that one? With the dogs playing cards? I think I've seen that before. Let's go enter the code and see what in the world are we pressing. How does he know what to press? What? Obviously 5798 is not going to work, a champ. Um, what is the answer? Okay. Bet I can figure out this code. I bet you could too. Maybe now it'll work. There we go. <laughs> okay. I've got no idea what led him to believe the other number was going to be right. Remy Nielsen insurance policy, take one. Friday night, August 14th. I'm going to meet with stocks. <laughs> Sounds like the next step is coming up with partnership terms that work for both of us. I think if you... Stoddard. Got you. I wonder if they got paid to include Hi, that, um... I found something. I'm headed downstairs. What was it called? I think... I can't remember what that machine's called. Now in the shipping container. I know it's a pretty, um, popular recording device, audio recording device. Uh, so we're gonna have to go around somewhere. No doors to open. Nope. Okay. Let's go down. Check back up on this. 22 meters that way. Who's that over here? On this doorway. On the other side of the door, we should be literally on that person. Can we go around this way? No, okay. I've got no idea who that could have been, but let's keep on looking and analyzing all of this stuff. Okay. It'd be kind of crappy if this is all of episode four, but we've got definitely some arrests to make. I know that for certain. Let's... Let's go 18 meters of that way. Got no idea how we can get further up here. 12 meters, eh? Maybe we need to go back down. That's the only thing I could assume we've got to do. Which is unfortunate because I would have missed something then. 27 meters. Here we go. On the right track. Gym bag of money. Oh yeah. Now. Where to? That is the great question of our time. What'd you find? Nelson Stoddard. On tape. Now when we go to IA, it's not our word against his. Remy was storing his cash somewhere. I bet Stoddard's looking for it too. Look in there. What the hell is this? Some bullshit I don't pretend to understand. But I looked online and the only place that sells that crap is a store called Domo Roboto in the Popcorn Mall. He wouldn't be storing his cash there. Nope. That's why I got the warehouse's address. It's worth a drive-by. Drive-by it is. Meet Kai, objective complete. I guess we didn't really meet him, though, did we? Actually, no, it's her. It's That's the female detective, isn't it? 
So I'm the, I'm the literally the worst person with names. So Detective Kai is the Asian lady that was just talking just then. And Stoddard is the corrupt cop. My advice? Don't go in through the front door. If Stoddard comes out without me, assume the worst. I always do. Nice to see we got a pessimist in the ranks. Alright, so she just dropped us off. Nick, I just got word from CP about a suspicious van. I'm gonna follow it, okay? Yeah, alright. Just stay in contact. Lousy time for a hurricane, huh? Tell me about it. I got two buildings. Lots of guards. Remember what Dawes said, Mendoza. Don't worry about reading these guys their rights. You won't lie? All right, let's get out of here. I'm assuming we've got to just run straight forward. I assume. Um, let's see. Is there another way out of here? Doesn't seem like it. Uh, let's just make sure we've got what I want. Tactical gear. I'm pretty sure I'd have everything that I want. A grappling hook, yeah, I guess. I don't really want a zip line. So I guess we've got to fall down, which doesn't seem right. Oh, okay. There's stairs here. I was gonna say, it definitely does not seem right having to fall down. This place looks locked up. Try the roof. Good idea. I had that idea myself. Now, <laughs> this is a little bit obvious that we've got to climb up over here. So let's go do that. Hope for the best. I'm not quite sure where that dialogue's coming from. We must be near someone that's talking. Obviously, the howling winds of the hurricane aren't helping either. Let's go start arresting these noobs. Freeze. Stay right where you are. You got it. You got it. I did read a comment about how many asking a question of how many um, handcuffs does this guy have? Uh, I'm inside a tortilla factory. Looks on the level. Okay, check the other building. Other building, you say? Okay, let's go to the other building. I definitely want to take down the alarm system, though, which is what's well, over there, isn't it? So. Maybe that's not going to really happen. Let's wait and see. We've got a guy. Oh, we've got two over here. None of them seem to be the actual guy that we need to take down either. Oh, one of the five guys that we need to take down. Uh, let's come up over here. Let's see. There doesn't seem to be anyone up around here. Let's just get a grasp of things so we don't go die. Hmm. So these two guys, this guy's coming back around. He's got a sniper rifle though. He's definitely... Oh, okay, this is one of the guys that we need to capture though, sorry. 